Minecraft, the game of blocks, creativity, crafting, mining, endless amount of anything really, but there has been an issue for a while now, which is the updates. Hello everyone, I am BoogieBoo22 and today we are talking about the new Minecraft 1.20 update and why, in my opinion, it's not a good update. Let's start with one of the issues. Usually each update takes up to a year or maybe longer, but that's not the main issue. The main issue is there isn't a lot to these updates. Yes, they finally added a new kind of biome, but that's basically the best thing they have added. You can get mad and say, it's not easy to code and add new things. You're kind of right, but remember, the end in the nether update. They brought so much stuff within about the same amount of time, even while COVID was happening. So don't blame anything on COVID too. This is a major issue between most of the players, because most players were excited for this update but did not have enough for it. There is little thing they could use. They could get ideas from the community, ideas from the modders, or anything really. You know, players waited for something that didn't even offer a lot, which happened a lot with the other updates, which is also an issue. Each update feels like there isn't a lot to it. Some people say Minecraft is getting too complicated, which is a dumb thing to say. Same as it, it's not getting Minecrafting enough. The thing with each update is it should bring something for everyone. There's different types of players. There's fighters, miners, not those kind of miners builders, redstoners, and so much more that would love certain things. This would be hard to do, but if you just put it in different updates, it could help a lot more with Minecraft. For example, a builder update for the builders, a new PvP update unlike the last one, which would help make the community more happy. Each update usually does not bring enough, like the wild update, which only brought some things that aren't very wild. Each update won't satisfy the entire community, but it could satisfy most of them, which Mojang and Microsoft definitely would should do. But we all know it's kind of for money also. Another issue is there's not much to do in Minecraft. You join Minecraft, get a house, go mining, gear up, and then go to the end, fight the inner dragon, then what? Nothing much after that. This is a big issue everyone can agree on. Instead of working on things during the game, like the nether and all that, try new things after the game. New bosses. Maybe after you defeat the inner dragon, a new boss will show up in a different dimension or some kind of like another end boss or maybe an after end game boss. You can add so many new things after the end, maybe more biomes, dimensions, stuff like that. For the people that are saying it's too complicated, Minecraft has gotten a lot easier with the automatic farms. You get better in your own world for after a while. At first it might be complicated, but after like, what, a couple days, you're basically already OP with so much good stuff. If it was complicated, so many little kids and people who aren't as intelligent wouldn't be able to play it, but it is, and it's fun and easy for the most part. Back on topic, it would be cool to have more after the end, maybe even armor, which is another issue. Netherite is a big problem within the community. In my opinion, netherite armor or the gear you get with tools and all that is not worth it. It takes hours to find netherite, which requires 24 netherite debris, then craft it into ingots, and then you can get your entire armor with your pick and also your axe or sword, whatever you use. But now, you have to travel for hours again to find a bastion to get a netherite upgrade to upgrade your stuff. It's a good idea, but definitely should be used for more powerful armor, and netherite isn't. For example, diamond has good durability compared to most, but it's a little less than netherite. For example, the diamond boots has 429 durability while netherite has 481. This seems a lot, but compared to other armors, it's not. Iron chestplate is 240, while diamond is 528. See the difference? Netherite is almost as strong as diamond, but like, five times harder to obtain, which is a big problem and controversy among the community. This also affects the community and the players of Minecraft because people like different things. Some people don't like to explore, which will make it hard for them to find the ancient debris or netherite upgrade. Others don't like mining, 
which is going to be hard for them to find the ancient debris because it requires a lot of mining and some aren't good at fighting which when you find the bastion there's a lot of fighting and nether is one of the most dangerous places so which is hard for them for something that isn't a lot stronger than diamond is definitely not worth it another thing is the weapons too if you use an axe the diamond axe does nine attack damage while netherite does 10. if you use a sword then the diamond sword does seven while netherite does eight it's one number off either they can add new better armor or make netherite stronger or make it easier to find now remember most of these are my opinion but how to fix these there is simple solutions that i made up first issue which was how long the updates take with low anything could be fixed by having more team working on the game or making it bigger updates like the end or nether update second issue which is not enough for each update could be fixed by putting more money on the game or trying to do more for the community instead of relying on the community to give them money because you know if the game has better updates then more people are gonna want more stuff on the game and they can pay more stuff you know how big companies are third issue is nothing after after you beat the end there's nothing this can be obviously fixed by putting more after the end because microsoft did tweet about this or put it out on a platform i can't remember where but they talked about how it's like a line and they've been trying to fit stuff in the middle instead of trying to put stuff after the end and obviously that's an issue you can add more challenges you can add some new bosses and more stuff after it and then the fourth issue which is the netherite problem you can make netherite stronger instead of harder to find or you can make some new armor and tools which can only be attained by defeating boss a boss or really anything now these issues are just some out of a lot but they're the most controversial and main issues the Minecraft community has about this update. That is really all I have to say about this. It's just, again, all my opinion. If you wanna say something, ask any questions, do anything really, just comment. I'll try to answer or someone will answer for you. Now, if you wanna see more like this, if you enjoyed it, you can like, maybe even sub. <laughs> but yeah, anyway, have a good day and see you later, alligators.